Hey everyone, how's it going and welcome back to the channel. In this video, I have a couple of exciting stuff to go ahead and show you. A brand new credit store update with an epic as well as a new lucky draw and also the release date of the SKS. So it should be a pretty fun video. Now, if you guys do like the video, a like helps out a lot. And also, if you're new around here, please do consider smacking that sub button and joining the family. But anyways, let's hop into the video. So starting off, with the SKS and when it is going to be in the game. So Card Mobile posted the following. A new marksman rifle is almost ready to deploy. Obtain the SKS through the BR buff seasonal challenge and this is going to be available on Friday. Now keep in mind over here they do say it is coming out on the 18th but that is going to be in PT time zone. So for example if you usually get new lucky draws on Friday then this is coming out on Friday in your time zone as well as your country if you usually get lucky draws on thursday then this is coming out on thursday for you and it's coming out on thursday in your time zone it comes out the exact same time for all of us but the obviously the day does differ friday thursday depending on where you live in the world so anyways to keep it simple we're all getting the gun in a day anyways moving on to the new credits or update also coming at the same time as the brand new marksman rifle being the sks over here we can see the five new items in this credit store update. We have an epic, the UL736 Solar Wind looking really sexy. We have that royal blue and the gold trimming. Overall, it looks pretty good. I do want to say this credit store update is a lot better compared to the last one we got. We're also going to have some other skins, the M4, the Arctic 50 and the HBRA3. Plus, we're also going to have the hacker class for Battle Royale returning if you did miss your first chance. So, a beautiful epic, plus three other skins, and also the hacker is returning if you missed it the first time. Now, we're going to move on to the brand new lucky draw coming to the game, and I am so excited for this draw over here. I think it is one of the best this season. Firstly, Witch Doctor Wrong Medicine, such a dope looking soldier, in my opinion. This one is a lot better compared to the first version we got of the skin. Obviously, it is modeled after a Plague Doctor from back in the day. It looks dope. I love the purple and the black. I think it is very nice. Now, also, we have the SKS Legendary Particle Splitter. And this thing is insane looking. Black body for the most part. And it has this purple medicine or purple some sort of liquid floating through the gun it just looks really nice plus we have some wings on the side of the gun why not why not the kill effect is also nice it's like an atomic or an atom type of looking thing an explosion which comes together not bad and also we cannot look past the actual iron sight which is a digital sight and well that over there is definitely an eye pretty spooky and kind of weird but we'll come back to the whole gun in just a moment firstly let's check out the full draw and for this a massive shout out to data miners hall starting off in this draw is going to be an emote he picks up a potion he drinks his potion and obviously as we can see over here guys it does not react well with his body he's like coughing it out all over the place it's definitely just not reacting good with his body he chucks it down and yeah it's a pretty nice emote not gonna lie on to the next item guys we have a sexy a folding knife mire and this is like the top of the range knife firstly the skin itself the mire skin looks beautiful but also it's a folding knife and we don't have too many of those so very very nice melee item next we actually have the sks particle splitter like i said nice looking gun grayish black for the background we have that purple just oozing through the pipes of the gun we have an eye for an iron sight and we also have wings on the freaking gun a very very interesting gun over there guys on some more we have the mw11 mire and this is pretty disappointing the animation on here is very very minimal like it covers almost none of the gun the animation looks good but it is so minimal that it's actually very disappointing in my opinion on to the next gun we have the qq9 mire and this is 10 times better we can actually see the whole animation it's like dripping and oozing off the side of the gun that purple color looks a lot better then we do have the legendary calling card which does have the witch doctor wrong medicine on there quite a nice calling card nothing crazy
on some more we do actually have the weapon charm which is literally a wrong medicine witch doctor's face on a keychain off the side of a gun yeah that's pretty dope then we have a smoke grenade mire if you do like grenade skins that's for you over there and then finally obviously my favorite in this draw we have witch doctor over here in the wrong medicine skin i love this skin from the moment i saw the skin i knew it was gonna be my favorite one for the season it's very cool the purple looks dope on the black it's quite a dark uh, themed skin i just like it good job on that one over there card mobile Good job in my opinion. But anyways, on to the gun in some more detail. And for this, a big shout out to Doge Beanie. Over here, we can actually see the legendary SKS in some more detail and more up and close. Firstly, obviously, we can see the eye digital sight, which really catches my eye. No pun intended. Uh, quite creepy. What do you guys think of that? Definitely unique. I don't know. Do you like it or not? Let me know down below. Also, we can see that purple, like, you know, floating through the pipes of the gun. I always like to see that on my legendaries. And also, we can see the wings on the side of the gun. It adds uh, some more detail to the gun. So, overall, I like this draw quite a bit. A lot of fancy stuff in here. Definitely my favorite one for the season. Animated skins all around. So, definitely some good stuff. But anyways, on to the final part of this video. A brand new game mode coming to the game tomorrow on the 19th as well. Over here, we can see we are going to be receiving Attack of the Undead but 20 players so it isn't really a new game mode it's kind of an older one which has been adjusted and now there is going to be 20 players overall in the game which means in theory it should be quicker paced more action-packed and a lot more fun in general so i'm definitely going to be playing that when it does launch in the game tomorrow so quite a few new stuff coming this weekend it should be a pretty fun weekend overall but otherwise guys that's going to be all for this video i hope all of you enjoyed it and i hope all of you guys found it helpful as well but for now that's all from me thank you guys again so much for watching and squally out cheers